welcome to all the viewers of this video we will now discuss the gfg problem of the day today the question name is count binary string with no consecutive one means there will be no binary string which has the alternate one means the one cannot come after the another one in this question you have given an n this is the length of the binary string you have to compute you have to count all the binary string of length n such that no consecutive ones will occur like in example 1 you have n equal to 3 then the string formed is triple zero 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 one one zero one one zero 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 one zero total string form is five which has no consecutive ones together <coughs> now n equal to two the output is three such that the string form is zero one zero zero one zero the in string form are three number now we will discuss the approach of this question let us consider the n equal to 1 the string formed are 1 and 0 now n is equal to 2 the string formed are 1 0 0 0 0 1 now n equal to 3 string formed are triple 0 0 0 1 1 0 1 1 double 0 0 1 0 this is 2 this is 3 and this is 5 We have seen that the list formed are Fibonacci series like this 2, 3, 5, and 8, and so on. But the missing number is 1. So if we add 1, then the string is Fibonacci. I hope you all know the Fibonacci series and how to compute it in. O of n times. In this question, we will solve how to find the nth term. So we so we have to calculate Fibonacci of n plus one because the one is missing. We have seen that when n is equal to one, the answer is two. So two is the second term in the Fibonacci series when n is equal to two. The answer is 3. 3 is the third term. So we have to calculate Fibonacci of n plus 1 at term for every n term. Let us wait. I hope you all know about the Fibonacci series and how to calculate it in O of n times. But in this question, we have to calculate the Fibonacci series in O of log n times. So, how we calculate the Fibonacci series in O of log n times? We will calculate it by using like this 1, 1, 1, 0. This is f of 1, this is f of n minus 1, these are f of 1, and 
f of n these are f of n plus 1 we have to calculate this answer only for n the given input so we will discuss we will only have to calculate like f of 2 so like this and matrix multiplication like this the output will be like this and the answer we have to output is this so we will only calculate the n plus 1 term for every n terms we will now calculate how to optimize the Fibonacci calculation in log n times by using exponential power like if the power is even we will divide it into a n by 2 a n by 2 If the power is odd, then we only calculate a along with it. This will help us to calculate the power in log n times. This is the code of how to calculate the Fibonacci series in O of log n times. This is the first term, this is the second term, this is the third term and this is the fourth term. We have to calculate this of having the power n. The output is f of n plus 1. The term that is n plus 1 is v0,0. So we have defined a matrix return type bin pow. In this we calculate the power by using the discussed approach of the calculating the power in log n times and then return the answer only i think that you will all understand the approach easily now i will end the video you please subscribe my channel for such amazing videos